What is your intuition saying right now? In this video, I wanna explore the intuition a bit more and some revelations that I've had recently that might be able to help anybody watching this video. Let's dive into it. So recently I've been on a quest catalyzed by a few encounters with some people who changed my life forever. And that has been to follow my intuition uh, much more. Now, first off, you might be thinking like, what is intuition or, okay, this is a bit quacky because the intuition can be wrong if it doesn't have the correct data. And the reality is the intuition is almost never wrong because the more that you are learning to trust uh, that intuition, that gut feeling that you have, the better you you get at discerning what is true and what is not true. The problem is, as Jordan Peterson will say, the more that we feed others lies, we feed ourselves lies, and we trick our internal guiding system into then following our lies instead of our truth. So the more that you can start to peel the onions of the layer back and get to the intuition, that gut feeling that this is right or that is right, the better you are able to make decisions from an intuitive standpoint, which calibrates with you and with what you know that you need to do. So that is a bit on intuition. Now, how do you follow your intuition or what does following your intuition mean? Well, first off, the gut feeling is the intuition or your intuition is this weird knowing that you have gnosis somewhere stored that you know you should be following. And if you don't, you will eventually get that whiplash of not following your intuition. But when you do start to follow your intuition, you're going to notice that almost instantaneously the things that you want to happen, that you aren't craving or needing to happen anymore, start to happen. So first off, following your intuition, you can train this as easy as how do I feel right now? How do I feel about this or that choice? And it can be as simple as wearing clothing for that day, or it can be as simple as choosing a food item that you know you should or should not have. When you start to do that, you are then better able to literally discern what your intuition wants to do. Start with small choices. You don't need to say, should I buy this house or should I not buy a house? Because that's gonna be something very challenging for you out of the gates to use your intuition for. You start very small and you slowly work yourself up. One of the things that I've been doing a lot lately to help build my intuitive sense and really hone in on my intuition is drawing cards from this uh, archetype deck that I have, almost a tarot style deck. And I allow my intuition to pick the card for the day and whatever card that is, it gives me a theme to think about throughout the day. Is it right? Is it wrong? Is it true? Is it not true? Did it happen by random uh, choice or happenstance? It doesn't matter because the reality of the situation is when I choose that card and I follow my intuition, not only do I refine more so my intuition, but I also give myself a theme to think about throughout the day, whatever that archetype is. So a lot of these things that may catalyze a uh, kickback in the brain, the shadow might come up and go, hey, what the fuck is going on? We should not be thinking about this, or this is just quackery. It doesn't make any sense. There's no science behind it. These are these thoughts that are purposely combating this because we are in a fair state that is coming from scarcity and it's not out of abundance. The more you can follow your intuition, the more you will be able to follow and create abundance in your life. So here's what I would say. Start really small. Maybe it's when you take a shower. Maybe it's the clothes that you choose to wear for the day, or maybe it's the food that you choose to eat for the day. Whatever it is, start really small with your intuition and allow it to work up because in time, you're going to start to have things that seem like ESP or premonitions happen to you. And that is one of the most beautiful things because it tells you that you are on the right path and you are, especially if you're watching this video, you're trying to figure out where you're going next. So I thank you for watching this video. Drop below how you're gonna use your intuition today. Otherwise, make sure to press subscribe so you get notified when videos just like this come out in the future.